flicks the pass up high to Huff. He turns around, floats up a jump hook from the right baseline, and he picks up where he left off last time out. Driving laterally, spins down low, nice move, and then he floats it over Funderburg and gets it to drop for his first bucket of the night. Kihei Clark, Clark dribbles into the paint, little teardrop, up and in. Eventually with a shot clock now inside of five as Key turns around, contested jumper inside the free throw line is a good one. For NC State, it's a pass to the left side, here's a long three point try, and Mamadi Diakite splashes it through. Three-pointer from Wolda Tensai on the right side. That just missed too strong, but an offensive rebound from Huff. He goes back inside and then flushes it through with a big one-hand slam in the face of Thunderbird, who was trying to draw the foul. Steps back now. This man was there with five seconds to shoot. Going to fire up a three. They'll say at his foot on the line as he knocks it down from the corner. Nice job by Coleman while he was out. Here's Key driving inside, slicing his way right through the heart of the defense for a layup underneath. The largest advantage either team has had in this game. He said it's been dip and tuck. Here's Jay Huff trying to answer, and he will do just that as he buries the three. Cavaro's in the game for the first time tonight. The first time in three games as Clark lobs up to him. Cavaro tries to power the shot up inside, and he wills. Kihei Clark to Yakite. Here's Kihei Clark attacking inside and laying it in on the drive with the left hand. He's being trailed by Helms. Takes it, pulls up at the left elbow, and knocks down a 15-footer. Clark, a head fake, drives in, passes to the near side. Morcel launches up the three, and he buries it. Cavaliers with their first lead since the 6.48 mark. A head fake, tries to put the shot up, instead hands off to Cavaro, who lays it in with a foul. Poppy coming up big. Trying to come up with a dagger. Goes into the air, fires the shot up, and he hits it. It's a five-point lead with 27 seconds to go. He spins it in his hands to make it a three-point game, and it misses. Rebound pulled down by Morcell. He's going with four seconds left across the midcourt strike. Casey's got it in his hands, hoists up the three for the win. No good. It missed short, and Virginia is going to lose this one in a heartbreaker, 53-51. to